Oh my god. Like, Champion Gundir and Nameless King were the two bosses that gave me so much trouble in my older playthroughs. Well, I, I only did two playthroughs. I only completed two, sorry. And, ugh, holy shit, doing that in the first try is just insane. I can't believe I did that. It, it feels like a case where I'm being heavily rewarded for going for a very risky intelligence build. Because at, near the beginning, beginning, I was having a lot of trouble. But now, oh man, it's really paying off. It's so paying off. Ah, oh, it feels good. It feels so, 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 so good. We know whose armor that is, don't we? What the message is. <laughs> Friend, you don't deserve this. Impossible. <laughs> Impossible! And another one right here. Quite something ahead. Dragon Slayer Spear. Let's read the lore on that, because I really want to read it. Ah, here it is. Golden line armor associated with the Dragon Slayer Ornstein from the Age of the Gods, and imbued with the strength of lightning. In the Dragonless Age, this knight who long guarded the ruined cathedral... Ruined cathedral? Left the land in search of the nameless king. Okay, well, what about the spear? Here it is. Cross spear associated with Ornstein the Dragon Slayer, a weapon of the gods imbued with the strength of lightning. Two handed thrust utilizes the support of the cross and requires great might, but can pierce deep into the flesh of dragons and send mere men flying. It's pretty fucking cool. Oh, <laughs> uh, what the? Oh, yeah, those are where the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because of the, the fog floor, the foggy floor, whatever. I didn't even know bloodstains could get up there. I'm pretty sure they would only, you know, go back on the platform. So that that's kind of interesting. Weird how the game would do that. Oh, I feel so goddamn proud of myself that I did that in my first go. I think with the Moonlight Greatsword, I'm probably just a little bit overpowered. <laughs> just a little bit. Yeah, go back to Firelink Shrine for now. I didn't think I would do two areas, you know, two difficult, bloody hard areas and bosses so quickly. I was expecting to do a whole session on those, so I'm I'm really impressed and proud of myself. Well, oh wait, hold on. I might want to have a look at what... Oh, I had a bit of a burpee there. Oh dear. Might want to have a look at what weapons I get. Uh -huh. sure. In transposition... Lightning Storm. Yeah, you need faith for that. Ooh, Storm Curved Sword. Tornado. But you need dex for that, so it's a very dex-heavy weapon. Could be fun, though. Could be fun. It's something I would try in the future. And Dragon Slayer Sword Spear. Which kind of sounds awesome. Yeah. So <laughs> that's some cool lore for you there. Now, now. Yeah, I did like how the nameless king sort of, you know, looked at his companion when he died and was like, "You don't deserve this. He doesn't deserve your power. Um, you're gonna live, Welcome live home, on in me." Very well. And it made him more powerful in doing so. Because, because you could sort of see the expression. On, on his body language that he, he really didn't want, want that, but it is the way he it is. Yeah, I don't want to get rid of that yet. Look at that soul, though. Pretty damn cool. Yeah, <laughs> that's some great lore there. In case you didn't know, it's very possible that that is... That it is <sighs> words. That it is the firstborn of Gwyn. So it's very possible that he is the the, the son, the heir to Gwyn. Uh, where do I want to go again? 
Ah, yes. I remember. Uh, here we go. I want to go onto that one. Because then that way, I can explore the new area that I didn't explore before in this DLC. Third time we're going back to Ash Ashes of Ariandel. That's kind of cool. Whereas we kind of did the Ring City all in one go. Oh, okay. This is fine. <laughs> yeah, th th this is fine. I'm totally okay with this. I want to check if... If she's okay up here. I don't know if I went up here, but we're gonna go up here anyway. Oh no. Are you okay? The basement's on. Um, basement. Cellar. No, not cellar. Give blood of the dark soul. What? Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Ah. Talk. Fashion one. Thy gift of flame has taken root, and Uncle Gale will soon bring the pigment. Pigment. Coloured like the dark soul of man. Ah. Uh. I wonder if Uncle Gale has found it. The pigment. Coloured like the dark soul of man. I guess I'll give it to you. <laughs> You're saying, do you want to give it? I, I guess I have to. My thanks, Ashen One. With this, will I paint a world. Please tell me thy name. I would name this painting after thee. <laughs> I call this, uh, the world of Dumpy. My thanks. I will paint a world of that name. It will be a cold, dark. And very gentle place. And one day, it will make someone a goodly home. Yeah, I guess. You, got, you have very long hair, by the way. I wonder when Uncle Gale intends his return. I hope the new painting will be to him a gentle home. Uh, I'm sorry to tell you on that, but that's a great big oof. My thanks. I will I of a cold yep. one day. Yep. I do hope it goes well. Uh, I, I like how this fire is just all here, but doesn't burn anything. It's like that, like that one chemical where it makes fire cold. I can't remember what that is, but there's like one chemical that makes fire very cold. Like even though it spreads and stuff, well, it doesn't spread. But even if it goes onto stuff, it's so cold that it will never burn anything until the chemical w wears off of course this is what i was meant to do that's it break 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 yay let's do it again <laughs> can i go down now yes yes i can oh yeah i've got got to, i've got to I've got to go on a good old mountain of shit before I get to the bottom. But that's okay. We can do it. Also means we meet we meet with with some old enemies as well. Yeah. Wait, how come you didn't take so much damage? That was weird. Oh well. It's not it's not a problem. Yep. Yeah. What a dodge that was. A boosh. Oh yeah, we can go and look at that tower. Actually, no, no, no. I think I'll leave areas like that. Yeah, I think I'll leave areas like that just because then... I have seen what's in there. No, it's not... It's not essential. Plus, I like leaving some areas unknown. Ow. Hey, they're not actually doing that much damage to me anymore. It's kind of a miracle. I can actually survive their attacks and kill them very quickly. But yeah, um, I, I won't go to the tower just because I like to leave some areas unknown so that when people want to play the game for themselves, they can explore new things still. So they're not reliant on my playthrough entirely. 
I think it's a very natural way of handling it. Oh. Oh, bugger. Oh, shit. Okay, thanks, game. I was trying to line myself up there, but it looks like I had no, no hope of that. I don't even know where that big guy was. But you know what, we'll do it again and we'll see if we can do it a lot better this time. Because I know I can, because I'm good at video games, not really. Well, I, I am at some. Some video games. Oh dear! That's it. Break, 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 yay! I love how the, how the wood just goes flying. It's like a weird Indiana Jones film, isn't in it? Indiana Jones film in the ice. That'd be kind of funny. Indiana Jones and the fucking frozen wasteland. Indiana Jones and Force Fuck Valley. Indiana Jones and who left the freezer open? Ah. Uh, oh, that was skill. It Eesh. So much damage, oh my god. Ooh, might want to actually go down here instead. So much damage, I love it. I'm a very happy chappy right now. What's up here, actually? Nothing. I wonder where all of these roots came from, though. Like, I wonder what happened here. It's kind of cool regardless. Oh, careful. Yeah, big guy shooting at me down there, any? Uh, okay, I've got to... I'll leave that crystal lizard alone from now on. That damage! Oh, no, never mind, it killed itself. <laughs> Silly crystal lizard. Oi. No. Yeah, that's right, bugger off. There's another- ah, there you are. So I've got to think about how I get up to you. Hmm. Oh, I guess I dropped down there, don't I? Uh, yoink. Be oh, careful. Okie dokie. Go up from here. Now I guess we drop down to this. Aha! You can bugger off, you can, mate. Wow, I fucking wreck them now. Before I used to ju just do piddly amounts of damage to them, now I can fucking destroy them. <laughs> hey, what's this? Oh, okay. And there is no item. Oh dear. That's not a problem. I thought there would be an item up there or something since it goes back round to the top. But I guess that isn't the case. Because usually the level of design does work like that. Look at that damage! My god, I'm gonna wreck. I'm gonna wreck it. Ralph wrecks the internet. I really want to watch that actually. It would be quite fun. Uh, boink. Aha! Suck it, nerd. Yeah, I want to go down the safe way. Oh, shh! Really? I didn't see any fucking arrows there. Oh my god, I have to do that again! I mean, I need to look back on that footage. I didn't see any fucking arrows. None. But then it's just like a random explosion and it kills me anyway. That was a thick layer of bullshit. I'm not a fan of that. Right, so I've got to, I've got to do all this again because it, I died at no fault on my own. Or at least it looked that way. It looked that way. So I really do have to check back on that and see if the game cheated me or if I'm just an idiot. I'm convinced it is the former. Because I would have saw an, saw an arrow there. 
I mean, especially with two explody archers shooting at me at once. I'm not gonna fucking miss an arrow now, am I? There's just no fucking way. There we go. Skillage. A uh, douche. Yeah, they fell off again, didn't I? A douche. Right, let's get rid of you two. Aha! You missed me. Aha! Hit me again. Well, you did have good accuracy, but I just rolled through it because I'm so good. Right, I'm gonna get down near. Okay. I'm, I'm not gonna lose, lose this time because I'm skilled. Right, you, my friend, you can die. Aha. Come on. Yeah, I've still got that one to deal with. Bloody hell, lock on. Come on. Stop being a fucking puss. As soon as I fire it again, he just puts his shield back up. You're a bloody wimp. Every time he keeps putting the shield up, it's so annoying. Uh, there we go. Headshot as well, innit? Right, come here, you fuckbag. Yay! Okay, th th there'll be fucking pushovers from now on. <laughs> I almost feel sorry for him. We fucking know what that is, don't we? It can fuck off is what that can do. Now you know what, since uh, since I'm sure people would want to see me, you know, fail miserably, I'm gonna give it a try for the laugh, for the shits and giggles of it. Come on boy. Come on Mr. Crystal Crabbo. Look at that strengthy. There's more crabs as well. Oh shit, it's already coming this way. Fuck me. No. I'm fucking avoiding these altogether. It's not worth it. It's really not worth it. So you can bugger off. Yeah, plop. Pretty flowers, isn't it? We know what tower that is, don't we? Can't remember how I get down there. Because I did actually watch someone get there, but I think I'm going to leave that alone for the playthrough. Praise the pyromancy. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm going to leave getting up there alone on the playthrough. Hello. Oh. Okay, these want to murder me. Yeah, these really want to murder me. The hell is that? Ow. Yeah, I've got, like, so much defense now for some reason. I don't know why. Okay. You're like an NPC, dude. Uh, boosh! Oh, yeah, you've got all, like, skull head and everything. What are you doing? Boosh! What the hell? Did you just block my attack? Yeah, he has, like, a little block in his... Jumping attack, that's weird. It's very weird. Uh, boosh! There we go. Oh dear. Okay. Ah, you're back again, are ya? I see. We, we did actually fight you before, I remember that. Very early, early in the playthrough. Well, I say very early in the playthrough, it wasn't now. It wasn't that early. Oh my god, I rolled! Come on. I definitely rolled, I can tell you that for a fact. Oh dear, red eyes. Okay, don't, don't, don't display that. I would not appreciate that. It's kind of cool though. It's a pretty cool 
boss. It's no Sith, but still. Uh, douche, damn it. Can we use a big old soul spear on you? And again. Oh shit. Completely out. Bloody hell. You really love dodging my attacks. And again, the third time. No, surprisingly not. A little bit out of range. Yeah! First fucking try. <laughs> oh my god. First try. That's the first time I fought this boss. Never fought it before. Oh, that, that is... I'm really proud of myself. I think I have become OP now that I've discovered the power of... The Moonlight Greatsword. Oh, there we go. Read message. Be wary of sadness. Yeah. I wonder whose gravestone this is. It might be Priscilla's. Ah, <laughs> sadness. Spare ahead, therefore sacrifice required ahead. It might be Priscilla's. But I don't know, there's nothing that really details it because I don't recognise the sword. So it does make me guess. Yeah, this is a beautiful arena. I really love this. I'm a huge sucker for snow levels. Yeah, that, that is cool. Well, we've only got one more thing to do and we can go and do the final boss. Isn't that nice? Yeah. Yeah, it would be. It is pretty great. So, I can get this finished, no problem. I know there are things I'm probably gonna miss, but... Oh, well, never mind. Hold on. Okay. I'm, 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 uh... I decide to sort of do it every now and then, you know, stop the footage so that I can sort of break it down into smaller chunks. I feel that might be a lot better rather than, like, one great big three-hour file. You know, it's just in case uh, OBS fucks up the encoding, so I would only have smaller bits to deal with rather than one giant bit. It, it would just be a lot easier, you know? <laughs> oh yeah, I got a Valor Heart, didn't I? Oh, uh, there it is. I want to try that, hold on. I want to try that. Ah, straight sword. Okay, so you have to dual weld it. Whoa! That is cool. That's really cool. <coughs> Pardon me. Got a little shield with it as well. What is this, the stability? Oh, 50. Okay. Ah. Boosh. Big old stabby. Boom. Like a lion, isn't it? Yeah. What is the lore of it? Weapon once wielded by the champion of the undead match. A special paired set consisting of a broadsword and a lion shield. The champion fought on without rest until he lost his mind. In the end, only his page and a lone wolf stayed at his side. Ah. Cool. I mean, that is kind of an, an excuse to have a... Oh. No, okay. I need to find the last undead bone shard. Yeah, I might do, I might do that. I might do that. Here we go. You can burn that. And now, we have proper multiplayer. Isn't that cool? <laughs> Co-op match. Join either two versus two. Co-op match? What the hell is that? Ah, okay. A brawl is like everyone against each other. That would be fun. Just sort of playing uh, with friends on this one arena. Kill a Flame, Grand Roof, Dragon Ruins, Round Plaza. That's cool. Having like a proper dedicated multiplayer mode like this. That's cool. That is really cool. Uh, 
There we go. Okay. Oh no, wait, 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 w